Hey, what's up all my Capricorns? You have reached my channel, Royal Revelations, and I am BJ Royal. All right, you guys, so I'm so excited to be back, y'all. I got sick. My kid went to school first week. He made it a week, and then he got sick. Then he got me sick. Um, so it's just been, uh, um, but I was sounding like Kermit. I was looking like Miss Piggy, and it's just long cute, okay? So I'm back because I didn't get to do you guys' uh, juicy details read. I did give you guys a bonus reading when I was recording the other ones but of course you know i just pull the signs as i go so we're going to use the um the egyptian tarot deck which is all major arcanas i just took these cards out so we can focus on the energy of the moon and the sun so juicy details what is being hidden from you and what will be revealed okay and of course i put you here to the devil so we can just focus on you capricorn okay so this is for anybody with capricorn placement in their chart i tell everybody tarot card readings i like advice you take it Oh, you leave it, okay? Either way, that's fine with me. It may not be a message for you, but it's a message for somebody, okay? So if you want a personal reading, all that information, any cards that I use, all that is in the description box below, okay? So first things first, we're gonna get this thing started off with the Black Moon Astrology card. So I just took the Zodiac and the, the Earth elements out. We're gonna get about four of these, so uh, possible Zodiac signs uh, that could be involved in what is hidden and what is gonna be revealed. These juicy details, okay, honey? So let's see what's popping off. Give me four cards for my Capricorns. What is hidden from them and what is going to be revealed? Aries, I am. Mm, not the Ram. I think Capricorns and Aries, they have this kind of uh, connection, okay? My mom is an Aries, uh, first of all. But I've had quite a few love interests that were Aries. And, whew. Spicy, okay, that thing is spicy, okay, so, but let's keep it moving, I ain't calling no names, no signs yet, for real, for real, okay. Fire element, desire, okay, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Oh, oh. Earth element, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, give me one more, I don't know y'all, what y'all got going on? Every time I get in y'all energy, every single time it's something. Let's see. Oh, mm. the moon is here. Okay. And I kept that card in there because I did a new moon reading, right? But I kept that card in there because, I, of course, I had to do Pisces, right? So this could definitely represent uh, the sign of Pisces. And then you have Aquarius at the bottom, I know, okay? So you guys might have... Pisces, Aquarius in your chart um, predominantly. If you do, this reading is for you. You might have Aries. You might be dealing with Aries. You might have fire in your chart. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Um, so there's a couple combinations. Um, but I feel like definitely Capricorn. If Capricorn is your moon sign or Taurus is your moon sign or um Virgo is your moon sign, okay? If you have an earth element and moon, or if you have a fire element as your moon, so Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Okay, so let's let's get this thing popping, okay? We use the Lenormand deck for my Capricorns. First, we're gonna pull about three cards for the moon, what is gonna be hidden, and three cards for the sun. So let's see what's going on, okay? All right, so we have the Five of Pentacles, Health. Okay. Okay, then we have the fox. Okay, so I might be a little sneaky now. Okay, and then we have um, the magnifying glass, right? And then we have the bridge at the bottom. So somebody may be wanting to mend something after they did something. Um, the five, this is, okay, so this is the tree. Uh, you, you guys familiar with the Kabbalah tree, um, but this talks about health. Um, this could be mental health, physical health, um, whatever the case may be. Um, then you have the uh, fox, 
okay so somebody i feel like is being very sneaky this gives me like a seven of swords kind of energy but i feel like somebody's being very sneaky they might be um not telling you something about their health but then somebody finds out about something so this could be literally somebody sick this could be literally a std this could be anything along those lines where somebody is not really being honest with you this also could be somebody that you're dealing with and they don't want you to know like their health status per se because they're kind of nervous on whether or not if that's a big deal. Hmm. Some birthdays that I have is May 14th, April 15th. April 14th. Somebody could have born been born in 1944 or 1954. Okay, let's keep it moving. What's the sun? Give me three for the sun. What would be revealed? Oh, a letter. So my birthday could be September 19th. That's this is literally the date on the letter. I don't know if y'all can see it, but September 19th. Is the date of the letter. So you guys might get a, a some type of communication this September 19th. That's actually um Sunday. It's getting kind of creepy, y'all. Okay. Let's see what else. Give me two more. Ah. The sun. Okay. Ah, a friend, okay, the puppy, okay? And then you have the doors, okay? So me, this is like a decision. It's borderline kind of the lover's energy, uh, but definitely a decision, okay? Um, um, some other birthdays that I get is, um, it could be March 18th, January 13th, August 13th March 27th February 13th July 31st March 17th March 11th Did I say March 18th? March 17th February 11th, February 18th, okay? All right, that, that, I think that kind of chimes with some of that Pisces energy too, okay? So let's see. Let's see how this is going to work out. Let's get a little bit more in depth. I'm going to use the Tower Takeover deck um, to get some overall energy, okay? So let's see what this person, this person is being sneaky about something, but I feel like it really is not as bad as somebody think it is. It's not really as a big deal as somebody's making it. I feel like somebody just needs to be honest about something. What's this? Uh, the tree. And the tree is also about knowledge, right? You have the artist here in reverse. And the page of wands here in reverse. Okay, then you have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like somebody may make a big deal about something. Because I feel like there was some type of lack of communication with the Page of Wands in reverse. And the artist is here in reverse. Like, I can't create. I can't. It's something about this person feels like they can't create or the perfect environment. Maybe it's their environment. But they just feel like they can't talk to you. You'll point fingers or something or you'll get mad. Like, what's this fox? Sneaky ass fox. King of Cups in reverse. Pisces energy, but Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Six of Cups. So this could be somebody from your past coming back. Give me one. One more for the King of Cups. 
Five of Wands is in reverse. Eight of Swords is here. So somebody is trying to... I'm not going to say they're coming in and trying to cause all these issues. But at the same time, I feel like this person is coming in and they're not genuine. You get what I'm saying? They're, they're trying to... Um, they, they always have been like this kind of self-sabotage kind of person. They have insecurities and I feel like it has to do, and this could literally be their physical health. I feel like their body, like it literally could be something going on with their body. It could be their mental health too. So if you're trying to figure out why somebody is acting in a certain way or you can't quite infiltrate, look at these birds up here in this tree, Right? If you feel like you can't get through to somebody or something, I feel like they have like some type of mental health issue. That's why you can't um, get into them. Like they're they're emotionally unstable. They're emotionally disturbed, right? I feel like the five of wands is in reverse. So I feel like they're not like rah, 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 right? But I do get a sense that they're, they're something that they can't kind of come to terms with. Uh, what's this magnifying? Okay. You have the three of swords in reverse and the five of swords here in reverse. And then we have the judgment here. Somebody really is scared to be judged, yo. But I get a sense that they're kind of putting themselves in this position because the five and the three here, that's giving me eight of swords energy in reverse. So you're still self sap Somebody is self-sabotaging. This is not the way to relay this information. Look how that uh, angel is kind of looking, right? Angel looking like, what are you doing? Like, right. So I feel like they do feel like or they have been judged prior to and they're scared to really kind of say something to you because I feel like they will be judged. They feel like they will be judged in the same manner. So we'll cups in reverse. Yes, they're scared that you will walk away instead of working on the connection. OK, so let's get these. uh the uh the tarot of the new vision what's the artist oh already popping out okay 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 we got three of them here okay whatever so we have the chariot here the king of swords and the lovers so i feel like and the queen of swords i feel like whatever this person is hiding it ain't even nothing to hide It's really nothing. If they just talk to you about it, um, I really feel like this is a conversation that could be had because I feel like you'll definitely be more supportive than they think you would. But the the irony of the situation comes in to where you're not telling me this, which is the reason why somebody might have an issue with it because you're not being vocal. Like the communication is is lacking here. You know, somebody can't really... I feel like somebody feel like they can't be give it their all with this artist in reverse, be creative, give it their all because this thing is holding them back. I feel like this is something that can be fixed with this King of Swords upright and this Queen of Swords because if, it, if, some, if it's something with somebody's health, especially their mental health, if they go to some kind of specialist or something, somebody is struggling with something that they clearly need help with. However, they're, they're not getting the necessary help that they need because it's really not as bad as it seems. Somebody just needs to make better decisions as far as their health goes, stop taking unnecessary risk and make better decisions about lovers, different things like that. What's this page of wands in reverse? This is a whole different kind of scenario, I know. Uh, but to clarify the page of wands in reverse, you have the temperance energy here, um, Sagittarius, but you also have the six of wands. That's why I said things are really not as bad as it seems. Now, I, now some people, some people might have a child. You see this little baby in the background? You can't really see, right? Um, Okay, so I feel like somebody may be in a position where Okay, so I hear like an abortion. 
And I know this is definitely a sensitive subject for people or somebody sneaking, do, getting it in an abortion, like to, to abort the baby or something. Or somebody is hindering like some type of growth of a child or some something in regards to somebody should be a little bit more open and honest about something that could potentially make their life better. You know what I'm saying? I feel like somebody might need some help and they're just not asking for help. They're not reaching out for the help or somebody might come to you and ask you for help. Or somebody might come ask you to like take care of their baby. And then you have to make a decision here. Okay, let's let's keep going. I'm just picking up on these different stories. What's this King of Cups here? Okay, but what's behind it? Wow. The Ace of Swords and the Moon. So Pisces energy again. But somebody is going to come to you with the seek with the truth about a secret that they've been keeping and i find like feel like finally this person is just like okay i'm coming to you look how he's walking up here with all these birds he has the information the truth is here he has the tools needed and i feel like after just sneaking around somebody finally just comes and be like look this is what it is like and maybe the king of cups is in reverse because he's spilling all of his emotions he's kind of like putting everything on the line here What's the five of wands? Maybe you don't know this person is planning to do this. Yeah, like, look, the knight of swords is in reverse and the nine of pentacles. I feel like this person doesn't want to come at you because they feel like you are kind of like moving on without them or you are content. But I feel like this person is going to end up coming to you um they might kind of come under the radar or they might be planning this under the radar radar or again they might kind of send you some type of communication just to kind of see what's this three of swords in reverse and it's five of swords in reverse the eight of pentacles and the three of wands somebody wants to fix Literally, if you can just read these cards, fix with the Eight of Pentacles, the past with the Three of Wands in reverse, okay? For me, the Three of Wands is always talking about future energy, but sometimes when it's reverse, it's just kind of like talking about the past, right? I feel like somebody really wants to come back and work on something that they did in the past, but is it because they were exposed or is it because that they... They know they messed up with you or or something along those lines. Now they're trying to come back and mend this broken relationship, whether it was a friendship or whatever the case may be, the two of cups in reverse. Somebody has something that they like. And I feel like when they tell you the truth, it all makes sense. When they finally let their guard down, because the three and the four here, that's giving me seven of wands, both of them in reverse. So that's giving me seven of wands in reverse energy. Like so as soon as somebody come clean, like the past makes sense. Give me one more. The sun. Yeah, it makes everything better. Sometimes just being honest and just kind of getting stuff off your chest just makes it better, right? It gives you a newfound passion. It gives you a newfound confidence. Cause I feel like this person is suffering and they're suffering for for I ain't gonna say no reason, but how they're dealing with you and how they're dealing with everything is just really not in the best light, I can say. What's this letter, though, that you're going to get on September 19th? Okay, the full new beginnings. The nine of pentacles is in reverse and the temperance. Yeah, again. I get a sense that somebody is just kind of throwing some responsibility on somebody. Like, hey, I kind of need you to do this. I don't have nobody else. I know you'll do it and you'll do it great because you're a Capricorn. And if I can't depend on nobody else, I can depend on you. That's kind of scary, right? Because what is it that they want you to do to take care of, to embrace, right? 
what's this uh mm, but the timing might not be that good okay the sun card is here but the the wheel of fortune is in reverse here and then you have what the hermit mm, the five of pentacles in reverse i kind of hear y'all saying like hey love you to death but i'm kind of on my own journey i'm kind of like trying to figure things out i'm not trying to leave you out in the cold it might be some things i can help you with but this level of responsibility that you want me to take on i just can't foresee it right now right especially after what this person has kind of done in the past what's the the puppy Yeah, the Eight of Swords is here and the Nine of Wands in reverse. And then the Ten of Wands is here in reverse. Somebody can't take on all of that responsibility. They will put themselves in a bad position. Let's just move on, clarify. Because I don't know why they want you to put, like, you're a friend. I feel like somebody's asking you're doing too much as a friend. Somebody's just asking too damn much. I'm sorry. It's too much. What's the food? The empress is in reverse. Somebody's talking to something about some kids. Okay? Somebody wants you to take care of their child, whether it's temporary, whether it's... But I feel like... Some of you guys might already have children. You know what I'm saying? It's something along those lines like you want me to do what? Not a pinnacles in reverse. I don't know why they would ask you to do this. Okay. Oh, that's way too many. Maybe because they don't. I just get a feeling that maybe they feel like they don't have anybody else to turn to. Yeah, with this page of wands here. And the ace of cups. The wheel of fortune. Excuse me. Again, this is some type of bad timing, right? Um, or there's some time that has went by where you haven't dealt with this person and talked to this person. I don't feel like you don't love... Like It's not that you don't love this person, but I just don't know if you love them enough to give them... To help them with this type of commitment this level of commitment because i feel like it is a lot what's the will of fortune in reverse the high priestess is in reverse oh wow and then the justice card is here in reverse look there's another baby it's a lot of babies look in the sun it's a baby kids over here in the bottom corner it's a baby over here it's too many babies okay somebody wants you to take on some type of responsibility that frankly they should be taking on or they're asking a lot of you and they're not really giving you every giving you the whole story or they're not and i feel like maybe you get the whole story from another source with this high priestess because look at these people on the side outside of the high priestess right they're her loyal servants so i feel like they may know things as well that's going on with her but somebody tells it the star came out for the hermit and then the ten of wands came out the two of cups in reverse. Somebody wants a lot from somebody that they're no longer dealing with. Like, you just gonna come dump this on me. I ain't talked to you and I don't know how long. You left me out in the cold. You did me this way, blah, 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 blah. I mean, whatever the case may be. And they just want to come back around and just like ask you for this. And I just don't feel like it's necessary. I don't even feel like it's more so money. <laughs> but I'm trying to tell you. The seven of pentacles came out in reverse. What's this, the world card that just flew out of nowhere? Okay, the, the world card is here too. It's not about the money. It's about the principle. What's the nine of wands in reverse? And I really feel like you the type of person, you like, man, I don't want to leave you hanging. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, spirit. Talk to me, honey. Talk to me. Two of cups in reverse. 
I feel like you're going to have to tell this person. You're going to have to hurt some feelings. And I feel like Capricorn, y'all good for that. But you're just being stern. And it's understandable, okay? So, <coughs> excuse me, I'm sorry. So, you have the Justice card here in reverse. And you have the Queen of Swords and the Hangman. Hey, look, bro. I don't want to leave you hanging, okay? But look at here, okay? I can't take this baby, okay? Look, look, look. I can't take this baby. I can't take this responsibility. I can't take this level. You need to get this child or get this person or do this, give this responsibility to somebody that can actually handle it because I can't do it. And I feel like you might feel bad and feel like you're like kind of chastising this person or you might just go ahead and you might not have had the necessary closure from this situation. So I feel like you may go ahead and tell this person everything that you're feeling. Like, hey, you need to get your shit together, okay? You over here coming out of nowhere, the woodwork, trying to put something on me. And I ain't even talked to you, seen you, heard from you. Hey, how you doing? Nothing. And you just going to come um, thinking that my guard is down, my defenses are down, and everything is okay. And you can just come back around and ask me for this big-ass favor? Absolutely not. Hold on. I'm, I'm clearing this so I can get y'all Oracle cards. So I can get y'all. That's just as cut as dry as it can get. Now, ain't nobody about to do all this you asking me to do. Who does that? Who asks who ask people this stuff? Like, don't nobody want to see nobody separate from their family or homeless or stuff like that. But, hey, look, you should. So I feel like somebody shouldn't be in this position in the first place. And somebody was kind of sitting in a position where they felt like they were very solid, you know what I'm saying? Somebody was being, somebody, I feel like somebody was really kind of being exposed. They thought they thought they were bigger than who they were further along or or something like that. I don't know, y'all. But you're going to have to make a decision soon. Probably by Sunday, the 19th, whenever the 19th is, okay? Because I did not recognize that on that card before. Um, So let me get the... Let's see. All right, Capricorns. Give me one card for my Capricorns. And this is a card. Um, this is a card out of my Divination of the Ancients, right? But at the bottom, you have Dice Gamble, okay? So sometimes in life, you have to take chances. But the card that came out, it says shooting star confirmation. Okay. This reading is confirmation. Okay. This is a magical moment. The universe is poised to respond to your wishes. And this card has turned up to confirm that it is so. You have felt this for a while, but haven't fully allowed yourself to believe it. But it's time to trust your feelings and know that all is perfectly fine. In fact, it is better than fine. You are truly blessed with heightened manifestation abilities right now. So take this opportunity to bring about all that you desire. Riding this shooting star through the cosmos, fill up on mystical stardust and know that whatever you wish for at this time will be granted. Your focus and positivity bring you good fortune. All you have hoped for is about to be realized. Keep your thoughts positive for your manifestation abilities are strong and can turn the outcome either way. Be careful what you wish for, right? So I feel like you may have wished or may have asked for some type of confirmation from the universe that you're on the right path, right? Um, I feel like this could be a test, whether you're going to take this gamble or really kind of focus on you, really kind of focus on your manifestations, getting what you want, what you desire. I think that this person is doing a lot. They want you to do a lot for them, and have you been promising yourself, I'm going to work on me. I'm going to do more for me. I'm going to make sure I'm straight before I can make other people straight. If this is something that you have been promising yourself, then definitely take the necessary steps to continue to do so. Just because somebody asks you to do something doesn't mean you have to do it, right? I'm sure you're not their only person that they can go to. Okay. All right, y'all. Well, y'all already know what it is. Please like, share, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. If you have, you know I appreciate it. So y'all already know what it is. Until next time, holla at a player when you see me in the street, pimp. Bye.